friends welcome to my channel jm learning today we are going to learn on staircase wiring systems now let us first know what is a staircase wiring staircase wiring refer to control of one lamp from two location with the use of two way switches which are also called as single pole double throw switch now these switches will be located at two ends of the staircase one switch will be at the bottom location another switch will be at upper location the lamp will be fixed at appropriate positions to illuminate the staircase whenever a person wants to climb up or climb down the given staircase now this kind of staircase wiring is using a two way switch so passers pass no what is the two way switch a two way switch will have a three terminals which are to be wired the middle one terminal is connected to the incoming supply system while the two terminal that is upper and lower are connected to two different circuits here we are denoting here by 1 and 2 as their terminals numbers as per this position shown in this diagram when it is at position number 1 the switch will connect the circuit which is being given supply through the terminal 1 output and that circuit will operate if we want to change the position of switch so as to operate another circuit then we have to just switch the position to number 2 and thereby the circuit connected to number 2 terminal will be given the phase and it will operate how this particular switch look like its front view is shown in the second diagram where this symbol shows the upper and lower positions we may call it 1 or 2 or a and b Now how do it look for the wiring connections the switch will have the three terminals the middle terminal is connected to the input side of phase wire and two outgoing terminals upper and lower will be wired to the two circuits to control the lamps now how these connections are to be done let us see in this diagram this diagram refer the use of two number of two way switches that is s1 and s2 and one lamp we have to control which is to be fitted at particular position in staircase to illuminate the staircase the switch s1 will have three terminals as we have described just now the middle terminal is to be connected to the incoming phase the phase wire will have a fuse to protect it from overload and any short circuit in the given lamp control circuit now the s1 will have two terminals outgoing that is upper terminal a and lower terminal b similarly the switch s2 will also have the three terminals its middle terminal is connected to the lamp holder terminals that we can call it as the right side terminal thereby the lamp is being connected to the phase wire system of given supply through the middle terminal of s2 now the upper and lower terminal of s2 and upper and lower terminal of s1 are being connected to each other through this wire which we have shown by the red lines so aa of s1 and s2 are to be wired similarly bb of s1 and s2 to be wired now the another terminal of the lamp holder is to be connected to the neutral supply system so that the circuit will be completed whenever the switch will operate in that case the lamp will glow now let us see how physical view of staircase wiring will be there as we know that the two switches s1 and s2 which are of the spdt category one of the switch will be located at the bottom locations or bottom end of the staircase that we can call as s1 another switch that is s2 will be located at the upper side of the staircase as previously described the upper terminal and lower terminal of s1 and s2 we can call it a and b respectively or we may call it 1 and 2 they are being connected to each other through the two wires 
the, these wires will be belonging to the face so they are shown by the red lines now the middle terminal of s2 is connected to a lamp and lamp holder another terminal is connected to the neutral we can observe in this diagram that there are three wires which are to be running from these two switches while the lamp holder will have only two wires all these wires will be housed in a given wiring system which we, we can prefer it may be casing capping wiring or it may be the conduit wiring or it may be the conceal wiring thereby it is only for our physical understanding that how the connections of the wires are being done in the staircase wiring this diagram is quite helpful to us now let us see how the staircase wiring and the lamp in it operates at the different positions of the switches s1 and s2 for better understanding we have put here on right side a two table which is having the three columns first is belonging to position of switch s1 another column that is s2 giving the position of s2 switch and third column gives us the lamp status whether the lamp will be in on or off states now let us refer to this diagram had described earlier s1 and s2 are two way switches so they are having the three terminals middle terminal of s1 will connect it to p while the middle terminal of s2 is connected to lamp another terminal of lamp is going to neutral wire when the switch s1 and s2 both are at the position b then the lamp will glow we can trace how the current will flow from the this p point it goes to middle terminal of s1 through middle terminal of s1 it will go to the b terminal of s1 as b of s1 and b of s2 are connected together through a wire so supply will reach to b terminal of s2 then it will go to middle terminal of s2 and thereby it finally goes to the lamp holder thereby the lamp heated in that will glow so here we have written as position s1 b s2 is on position b then the lamp status will be on as shown in figure now if a person is there which is standing at the position of switch s2 we can call it the upper position of staircase now he want to put that lamp off so what he can do he has to only switch the position of s2 from b to a when it is done s1 is still at b position now s2 will be at a position what can be status of lamp we can again trace the circuit just like this p to middle terminal of s1 then b now b will go to b of s2 but b and middle terminal of s2 are now not connected because the position of switch is shifted to upper side that is a is connected so circuit will not complete and the lamp will be in off states now if there is a person which is now at the location of switch s1 that is as lower side of staircase and he want to operate that lamp then in the given situation the lamp is in off states so he will only have to do to change the position of switch s1 which is as the b to a now the s1 will be at position a s2 is already at position a then the lamp will glow because now the current will flow from the phase wire to mid terminal of s1 to the a terminal of s1 a and a of s2 are connected together from a terminal of s2 to middle terminal of s2 and thereby it goes to the lamp holder and there will be a supply of 230 volt appearing across the lamp holder the lamp will glow so for position of s1 a and s2 a the lamp status will be in on state now when the person has again reach at the upper or top side of staircase and he want to off the lamp then he has to do only the change the position of switch s2 it was previously on a now it will be on position b in that case the circuit will not be completed because the supply has reached to the a terminal of s2 now a and middle terminal are not connected so ultimately the supply and current will not flow through the 
give one lamb circuit and lamb will be in off states by observing this two table we can very easily conclude that whenever the switches s1 and s2 are on similar position that is either on bb or either on a the lamp will be have the on status means when the upper terminals are connected and lower terminals are at same positions of switch s1 and s2 the lamp gives us on status while for another cases when s1 is on b position that is lower and s1 is on a position that is upper the switch the circuit will not complete and lamp will be in off state similarly when s1 is on a position that is upper and s2 is on lower position that is b then again the lamp will be in off states so this table helps to understand the operation of staircase wiring with this i am sure that you got the basic understanding of the staircase wiring connections how the lamp operate at different status of the switch position s1 and s2 and you also learn what is the two way switch which is a important element in a staircase wiring thanks for watching this video do like and share it